Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Art Use. In this video, I'll be showing you how to create use case diagrams with ChatGPT. But before we start, hurry up and check out the software just under this video. So let's get started. In this case, you might be wondering how do you create a use case diagram here with the use of ChatGPT. Well, using ChatGPT here is very easy. You just need to use or you just need to know what type of commands they need to issue ChatGPT to get the correct output. Now, in this case, since we want to create a use case diagram, we need to first describe to ChatGPT what the output is going to be. Now, what is your expected output? So in this case, I'm going to use the following prompt. So in this case, I'm entering a command here for ChatGPT to give me a use case diagram of using butter for your breakfast. Now, let's go ahead and press on enter and see what is the result. Now, it's going to give us different results here. So in this case, the different elements of your use case. So we have actors, use cases, relationships here. But in this case, uh, what do we need that we really need for this project here? Sometimes ChatGPT would give you the output or the actual visual representation of it. But in some cases, if it doesn't give you this visual representation, which in this case, as you can see right now, is currently describing the use of butter for your breakfast. In this case, again, like what I said before, in some cases, it will not give you the visual representation. Now, if that happens to you, what I like doing here is I just need to type in the following, which is going, this is going to be, uh, going to be Give me a visual representation of this and just press an enter. Now it will start generating an image for you. So in this case, it might uh, generate so in, in some prompts might not give you the correct output here, but in my case, usually this works. So you could just uh, copy the prompt here. Let's go ahead and click on no. And in this case, let's show you enter it again. And hopefully it will give us the image. As you can see, I've just re-entered it again and it got it correctly. So in this case, it will generate a few minute, a few seconds here, sometimes a few minutes, depending on the speed of your internet. But yeah, so in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.